after about a minute this is good and we're turning up the heat because I got me curry it's all done mm. chai Hey guys, this is Ify and welcome back to my kitchen. It's the holiday and I'm usually very excited about this, this holiday season. It's not like I'm not usually excited all year round, but there's always something in the air during this festive period. I know you know what I'm talking about, but hmm, I think my family is usually much more excited than I am. And I strongly believe it's because of my goat meat curry. Hmm? <laughs> anyway guys, I'm gonna be sharing my goat meat curry recipe with you so you can make it and put it on your Christmas table so your family and everyone around you can get super, super excited as well. So without further ado, no, 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 wait, face. Are you subscribed to my channel? If you're not, guys, come on now. It's the holiday. Put a smile on my face and click that subscribe button and notification icon as well okay so without further ado let's get right into it okay to make my amazing goat meat curry we're going to need some curry powder seasoning powder some paprika powder onions cut bonnet peppers this is onion powder some black pepper some cayenne pepper you need goat meat and i'm using goat meat with the skin on you, if you can find it with the skin on even perfect if you don't have skin on I mean it works as well we're gonna be needing some potatoes some vegetables I've got green red um, bell peppers and some carrots I also need some cooking oil dried parsley dried thyme and some salt let's get right into the cooking action to begin we're going to season our cleaned goat meat okay and um, to start, I'm going to put some curry powder. I will be seasoning this with some black pepper as well. Some paprika powder. Onion powder. This makes all the difference, guys. Some seasoning powder. Some pepper, some pepper powder. Dried parsley as well. Dried thyme, not so much. And some salt. I'm gonna go in here and then make sure every part of this goat meat gets some good loving well massaged and all the seasonings get in there so once you're done um, ensuring that every piece of this goat meat is well seasoned you're gonna take your clean film cover it and leave this to marinate for at least an hour Okay, you can do this overnight, but please not less than an hour, okay? I'm gonna leave this. After an hour, we can proceed. The next step is to add some cooking oil to your pot. Okay, so we're gonna wait for this to get hot. I'm gonna add in some curry powder. There it is. What we're doing is to um, allow the flavors of the curry powder to awaken, you know, so it can flavor our dish really well. Mm. Guys, don't skip this process, it makes all the difference, okay? So we'll leave it 
and stir occasionally. We're going to do this for about four to five minutes. You notice how the curry powder has changed color from like bright yellow to almost brown. Yeah, that's what we're looking for. I believe this process is called to burn the curry. Okay. So now we're going to put in our marinated goat meat in here. Just going to put everything in. Stir this. And then I'm going to leave this to allow the goat meat develop some color. You can see that the, the meat has developed some really nice color. Apart from it developing color, this is also a lot of flavor. Okay, so we're going to go ahead with the cooking. Add your onions. Cut one of peppers. We're going to give it a good mix. So good guys, easy serving. Okay, at this point I'm going to add in some water. So this can cook the meat. I'm going to add some muscle because I think this could do a little bit of so fam remember to check your goat meat from time to time i've been checking mine and i've been adding water as i go along the whole essence is to get the goat meat to be nice and soft we're getting there it's getting soft so we're getting there not yet soft enough so make sure you keep checking it and you keep adding um, water okay so I'm going to keep this, we're almost there. So while this is still cooking, I'm going to go ahead to cut my vegetables. Ladies, and if there's any guy that you've been targeting, <laughs> this is the recipe you want to make for him. And guys, if there's any babe that's still forming hard babe for you, just make this one and it's game over. Trust me. Look at how tender the meat is. But look, see how easily the bone came off. Ha! Ah, this one is beautiful. Okay guys, so you can end it at this point, but because we don't do basic over here, we're gonna add some vegetables, okay? Beautiful color. Look at this. And then stir. And guys look at this is how you want the sauce to be it's not too thick it's not too light this is going to go so well with rice very very juicy okay so we're just going to leave this for one more minute 
and then turn off the heat okay because you still want your vegetables nice and crunchy oh ha, ha, this is yummy after about a minute this is good and we're turning up the heat because I got me curry it's all done mm. chai and that's how you make an amazing goat meat curry guys super easy delicious and everybody is going to thank you for it trust me and when you make it do not forget to come back and leave me a feedback okay i always always love to hear from you guys all right thank you so much for watching do not forget to hit that subscribe button and notification icon as well i'll see you in another recipe video until then Take care and keep eating good food. Mwah! Bye!